feeling? Stacy Clark has been handed a 24-month demotion to the rank of inspector for her part in what's been called a cheating scheme at the Toronto Police Service. Just very disappointed and very sad about it. Uh, there's a lot of uh, people who have shared these types of experiences. Clark was the first black woman to earn the rank of superintendent at TPS. During the tribunal, she admitted that she provided confidential information to six black constables ahead of promotional job interviews in 2021. Her defense lawyer argued she wanted to help level the playing field against systemic racism within the police force. As part of her decision, the hearing officer acknowledged the presence of systemic racism but said it does not justify Clark's actions. Clark's lawyer had asked for a shorter demotion and an automatic reinstatement to the rank of superintendent. But the hearing officer denied the reinstatement, saying Clark's actions illustrated an abuse of position and power. She can reapply for the position in two years, but some don't believe Clark will be allowed to move back up the ranks. Unless they expunge all of this, Superintendent Clark could walk on water for the next two years. This will come up as part of that process in the future, irrespective of anything that she's done in a corrective manner. I think it's been an extremely harsh punishment and merely a reflection of the justice system and the treatment of black people from slavery up to now. In a news release, the Toronto Police Service says it respects the outcome of the tribunal. The release also outlines how the service is actively working to address the systemic racism discussed during the tribunal. That includes reform of its hiring and promotional practices to ensure a diverse workforce and a working group co-led by the OPP to modernize how workplace issues are identified and addressed. As for Clark herself... There's a lot of work still to be done. There's a lot of work that still needs to be done and I'm confident that we'll get it done. She says she wants to move forward from the tribunal and will take some time to think about what's next for her. Tyler Cheese, CBC News, Toronto.